I grew up in a Catholic home. We just learned religion and not so much um, relationship with Jesus Christ. Uh, growing up as a kid, um, I was an altar boy, went to church regularly, didn't know much about a relationship with Jesus Christ. In my teen years, sexual sin began and um, that was at age 12. At age 13, I started drinking. I come from a family of uh, alcoholics. My teen years, I was the rebel child, would get into trouble, just very uh, destructive life I had as a teenager. Ran around with a semi-wrong crowd in high school, drank alcohol, smoked weed, did drugs. So got into drinking, a lot of sexual sin, walking in sexual impurity. With the drinking, I was getting DWIs is what it was called in that day. Still, it was coming in and out of um, jail, basically. And at 27 and a half, I just had this revelation that I needed to change my life. And I stopped drinking July 15th, 1985. But I swore to myself I was not going to be a born-again, Bible-thumping uh, Christian preaching the Word. So it was a 10-year process of trying to do um, rehab, 12-step groups. Yeah, apparently that did not work out. And then coming from a background where marriage wasn't modeled, my older brother, for some reason, two brothers growing up in the same household, he managed to get being married. Uh, I was married in 1987 to my son's mother. We're married for 15 years. It was a very turbulent marriage. We were both um, headstrong, um, both unbending, both prideful people. Our marriage ended uh, in 2002. The irony is though, we're, we kind of did the reverse. We got married, we got divorced. Now we're pretty much best friends. I came to the Lord in it was the day of the Oklahoma City bombing. It was April 19th, 1995. I had a cousin who, her and her husband were pastors in Los Angeles, um, East LA. She came down for Easter and asked me to take her to a Christian church here in Tucson. She didn't ask me, she just took me by the hand and basically dragged me up to the altar to the pastor there. And the pastor asked me, well, do you want to be saved? And I said, I have no idea what that means. So he explained it to me and I said, yes, I'd like to. Here I am, a 21-year-old born-again Christian. I'd like to say it would be nice if God had blessed me with a singing voice because I'm thinking of the song, Amazing Grace, how sweet the sound that he saved a wretch like me. Hi, my name is Rob and I'm part of the body here at CCF.